Hey guys, welcome back to Civilization VI Rise and Fall as Latero of the Mapuche. Great to have you guys back as we continue both the war with Gandhi and dealing with the emergency, which Rome has put up zero fight. I haven't seen any activity from him whatsoever. No units or anything like that that have come into our border or have been any level of concern. moving these guys around a little bit we'll go ahead I, I think we're gonna go after wig town that's what it says wig town right now now we can go over to Monty and get some production and other things we're building a spy to protect our city of Nagmapu because uh, some uh, some AI took our science three more turns and we will upgrade these guys so in the meantime let's first we'll upgrade him there we go promote I keep saying that I keep saying upgrade you want some jeans Cosmetics. I think we can do this deal. So we can get a little more cash out of them, though. No? Eight? No, you want seven. Seven and fourteen flat. And amber. Not the best deal ever, but... No big deal. We need to renew our... Alliance with um, Peter here real quick We are still in a golden age Which is helping out a lot too. I was hoping we'd get a Little more production going. What is this achievement unlocked drama queen? Ongoing military emergency. Yes, we're aware of this We capture Mumbai which is his capital Yeah, okay, all right, well. <laughs> in Mumbai, that's hilarious. All right, well. I don't know, guys, that emergency thing is going to be kind of weird, because... There, trigger Eureka for rocketry technology, 20% productions towards space projects. So, let's go ahead and grab that, because that's what we want. And where is that guy? Because we can use him. I'm probably going to use him for the... Um, here he is. Probably going to use him for satellites. So, let's get him here. Now, this other guy... Oh, that's because we've got our uh, build unit right there. Okay, well, we'll skip. And I don't want to unnecessarily move our artillery into city bombardment range. And we can plunder. Outstanding. So we shall do that then. And fire. Alright. Kind of, sort of, didn't want to do that, but now that we have, it's a done deal. Let's just have him heal. And let's just move our airplane back to the airport. Or back to the aerodrome, airport, hangar, whatever the hell you want to call it. Fortify. And let's grab some coinage. As if we needed any. We're at 12,000 gold. Alright, so, well, what we could do is... 
Only nine turns for satellites? Wow. Okay, that's some awesome production. So probably a result of our golden age. So I shall stop complaining. <laughs> um, all right. So this is Mumbai. Let's get a stock exchange. All right, Envoy. We definitely want to get... Who do we need back? So we got Brussels... Where is Mahanjadaro? Okay. You know, I, I want to do Mahanjadaro, if for nothing else, the culture. Uh, Zanzibar, I'm going to put one in just... I mean, I'm not... Over, at this point right now, guys, honestly, there's really no threat from anyone. Uh, so I'm not, like, majorly concerned. We could probably use some farms here, can't we? We might make a farm right here. So I'm not really overly concerned militarily right now. Um, as far as anybody coming after us now, yeah, Catherine is just, just not, I'm not really concerned with that, but Gandhi here with his four of eight is really kind of annoying, but no military threat. He finally made it. We'll just work the iron. I guess we can always sell that to one of our other people. Well, some of our allies and whatnot. Oh, we got to do that with Peter. Now we're getting denounced, which is not unusual at this time of the game or this stage of the game. Something that all of us that have been playing for a while are accustomed to now. The DLC came out February the 8th of 2018. Almost at a month. So probably by the time you actually hear this video, it may be... The 8th of February. I don't know. Maybe sooner. Because the, the videos are um, stretched out a bit. <clears throat> it's, uh, well, I play more than one game in one day. And so what happens is that I'll stack, stack them up. Okay, so I don't want to use him just for 7 turns on the... But I'm going to put him in skip mode. So we Well, maybe not. We'll just skip him for now. Because it can get a little tedious after a while. Always skipping. Well, we'll go ahead and get a research lab. Because we've been doing a lot of um, banks and stuff. Well, here's speaking of banks. Now let's go ahead and get a military academy. And let's see. Delhi. Might get... Let's go ahead and get a sewer. Because he's 14 of 15. Repair that. And what I might do is when we go with our next policy like right now we can go ahead and get builders for these cities over here we'll move him there get him ready for wig town wig town looks like they've got a few um barbarians over there okay well we haven't taken the city yet so Wow, that is explosive. So now we're going to take another one of his cities. All right. We're probably going to work the sheep, most likely. Yep, I'm going to work the sheep. Maybe clear some of that rainforest. We have five builds with him, so that's a decent amount of builds. Alright, and our plane's back here, so let's just put you on alert. And I don't see any reason to fire on Rome, to be honest. Um, so that engineer is just going to go back to the one of the cities. We'll keep the city. I wonder what it's going to be like after our golden age. Uh, right now, with us being in a golden age, it probably makes uh, keeping all these cities very easy. I don't think we've put much of a dent on Gandhi and his religious victory. Nope. We'd probably have to just wipe him out. Which I don't really want to do. But 
I'm not. He's not really a concern as far as a religious victory, but we can always take Wigtown too. All right, we'll go here then. Oh, we got the Great Zimbabwe. He's he's a major wonder builder. Yeah, Great Zimbabwe plus five gold. So we got another wonder from him. He wasn't doing much up here in his jab city. Alright, so why aren't we changing policies here? We want to do that now. I just realized what I did, but we can make uh, some builder here. Uh, a builder here, at least. With that upgrade. 42 turns? What? Oh, I didn't get a chance to renew our alliance with Peter, so now he's mad at us. 42 turns. So we're gonna get plinked by some uh, archers. <laughs> wow. From Stettin in the Baltic to All right. in the So there we go. Plus one era score for Atomic Age. And we'll go to Montezuma. Here's our other artillery that we probably don't need. I will just move him over to here for now. Right here. You can group up with those guys later. And I don't want to use you yet. Yes, yeah, right. If you're going to go emergency against me, I'm going to make you pay for it. Okay, so let's change out our policy. All right, so we got to go all the way here to globalization and social media to get another uh, promotion for our governors. Rapid deployment. And we can go ahead and get our space race. Right? So right there. 15% production space race project cities has either a military academy or a seaport. So now you guys know why I built those military academies in the two cities. Meanwhile, you can probably make that industrial zone right here. And use that to make good use of that tile. So now you see why I made the academies in the two cities that I wanted to... uses my spaceports so that we can take advantage of that bonus you can let's okay so now let's change out our policy and we're just gonna grab that's new nuclear device maintenance reduced by 50 percent okay Oh, we already have it. That's right, since we got those other wonders, we had those additional bonuses. Alright, so... Move you here. And we're going to Wig Town. And we're just going to cut through here and go straight to Wig Town. And, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, you know what we didn't do? You know what I didn't do? I didn't select upgrade. That's okay. It's not like we really needed to. Oh, he, can he go one more? No. Okay, never mind. Skip. And let's get that farm down. Let's get you out of here in case... Those dummies have something stronger, but they shouldn't. All right. We got a slinger. All right. Let's clear some of this out here. Next turn. All right. We captured a spy from China. 
Not very nice of you, China, to be spying on us like that. What? Got away. Oh, when we took um, Sterling, I ended up getting our our um, spy back that he had captured. He had actually captured one of our spies um, earlier in the game. Okay, let's see. This city really needs some production badly. So let's... How many builds do you have left? You got five builds left? Okay, we're going to clear that rainforest or the... What do they call it in this game? Not a rainforest, but a what? Yeah, rainforest. Okay. Jungle is what we call it in Civ 5. Okay. Let's see. You can... You're going to hang here. You... Oh, you, you, you can't go that far. Why? Oh, there you go. You can go all the way in here and maybe pillage. No? Oh, he's right there. Well, we went one over. I don't think we can do it now. Maybe the, uh... Nope. thought maybe the artillery could do it, but I guess not. We'll go ahead and fire. Yeah. Wow. Okay, well, uh, we... <laughs> we, uh, don't need the other artillery, but uh, we'll bring him along. You can... Maybe head down. We might have to just wipe... Gandhi out. We may have to wipe Gandhi completely out. You can start moving down this way too. We'll move you all the way to here. And then we have this other artillery. Where'd our other artillery go that we were going to upgrade with? We had him going over in this direction. He's going to be over here somewhere eventually. The only other concern that I might kind of have is with Robert the Bruce. He's got helicopters and he's got tanks. Which, if nothing else, could really just be more irritating than dangerous, but you never want to underestimate him. Let's see. What can you do, guy? Maybe make another... Maybe make a minor... Wait, we'll get some rice. Wait a minute. Are we in range of that rice? No. That's coral. Are we in range of them? Well, iron would just be what we can work. So, all right, well, we do need some more farms. So, or we can make fisheries. We could move um, Liang over here and make some fisheries. That's something we could think about doing, especially when she gets her next upgrade. Um, yeah, we have aquaculture right here already. Do we have it? Yeah. We have it already. Okay, so let's move her to Sterling and just get some, like, aquaculture going. Just to check that out. Because it looks kind of cool if you guys haven't seen it. So that'll work out perfectly. We can go ahead and turn that into a mine and then we'll just make a bunch of aquacultures. We're just going to go up here and clear the fog. Of course, we'll be able to clear it once we get satellites, but... We can change him to Spec Ops, and now we have the ability to get drones. Um, I don't know if the balloons go to drones. Of course, I thought I made one, but we didn't, or I didn't. Okay, so we rear assign Liang. That enemy escaped. from China and we want to get our spy down here in Magma Poo because they managed to steal some of our science from down here which wasn't very nice that was not nice at all I don't appreciate that in any way shape or form all right so we'll go ahead and get these guys formed up the two subs and I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave him here and let him form up with the other artillery that we have and so we'll go ahead and fire
And I'm going to move you right here and let you sit here. I was just seeing if there's like some other little islands or something. Yep, you get an upgrade. Alright, we definitely want to make sure that our alliances continue with the guys that we do have alliances with because like for right now, Peter probably is not going to... Yeah, he doesn't want to even talk to us now. And we'll just go ahead and get a military academy in Calcutta. And over here, we'll make that one last sub. Well, no, we'll get the trade route. I saw that we had another we had another uh, spy we could make, so that's something we could consider in another city. And I'm going to leave him up here just to keep an eye on Robert. And he should be able to move and fire. He doesn't need to fire, so let's move him down this way. Let's go ahead and take the city. Wig Town, ladies and gentlemen. Wig Town. And, oh. Should we give it to Scotland? Yeah. Let's give it back. And I don't know if that's going to improve our relations or anything, but... Worth checking out. I didn't want that city anyway, to be honest with you. Um, just be one more city for us to have to deal with. We'll give it back to him. Let's see what kind of relation... What type of relations that builds with him because we returned his city to him. Kind of curious. Alright guys, I think on this note as we complete this turn, I'll go ahead and wrap up this game. Guys, consider clicking on that follow button if you're on DTube or Steam it. And if you are on YouTube, go ahead and click on that subscribe button so you guys will get all of the latest gameplay. We're going to move away from Wigtown. And I'll have to... Here, there's that other artillery guy we were looking for. Let's go ahead and move him all the way over to here. Wait, we can move him one more? Okay. And we can actually form him up. All right, guys. I'm going long. Okay, guys. Um, I will see you in the next game.